projects not far from each other, causing all kinds of issues. But kind of going back to the water main break, Brianna Ray Turner has been out there, but at least we're hearing it sounds like it's fixed, right. but they still have to repair the road. They are getting somewhere, but look, it's going to be an issue for your morning commute. It has been a headache for so many people. We've heard from a lot of you, our viewers, who have been emailing and calling in. We understand, but at least they're getting somewhere, right? We're going to turn things over now to On Your Side's Brianna Ray Turner, who's live right along San Jose Boulevard with an update. Good morning, Brianna. Good morning, Keith. Oh, yes, things are flowing, but yep, the morning commute could still be affected. Um, JEA spokesperson says that the crews will probably be out here until uh, late this morning, midday. So um, still um, keep in mind that the commute could be affected. Um, JEA spokesperson says repairs are completed, but they are working on uh, the hot asphalt patches. The good news is that, again, they're going to be fully off the road. They're expected to be fully off the road um, with all lanes open by late morning, midday. Now, as of Thursday night, four lanes of traffic on San Jose Boulevard were closed as crews dig, dig, dug more than 10 feet below the surface of the road to repair a water main that is two feet in diameter. So right now our crews are looking to put a repair clamp on it and hope to be the solution to the problem. Uh, what we'll do is we'll repair it, we'll pressure test the main to ensure there's no additional leaks, and then road restoration will begin. So like I said, traffic is flowing right now, but again, they won't be off the roads probably until late this morning, midday. So if you have an event, if you have something to do, I would get on the road early. I'm live here on San Jose Boulevard, Brianna Ray Turner, First Coast News on your side. All right, thank you so much, Brianna. Glad you're staying on top of that for us, and we'll continue to bring you guys updates, hopefully when those lanes reopen. All right, now.